Everything you, you are imagining, you can just make it from a clay. Lots of uh, things that are made from the clay is uh, made by hand. I've never done a, a pottery class with five bags of chips in the middle of it. You know, the lasses had some chips, which is great. You know, what's, what's wrong with that? You know, I think, you know, you've got to understand why people are here and, and, and enable them to get the best out of it, I think. And um, yeah, they did great. I think. Some of the lasses had really good skill level and just being able to communicate with one another and you know and just enjoy their time here. At first I was a bit nervous. Um, I was a bit sceptical to come and then as soon as I'd done the first session I enjoyed it. I wanted to carry on. The pottery um, was a way to have young people come and participate and join in a group without the intenseness of being in that group. Making something in pottery, designing something, focusing on what you're making takes away that intimidating surroundings and they found it easier. They found it easier to get to know each other, have conversations because there was never that intense having to look at each other. The fact that others were having no go, you know, they didn't care if it was right or wrong, they were just having fun. Everyone was all smiles and stuff and they got on with it. It helped me like get on with my stuff too. It made me feel relaxed and I, uh, in, when, while I'm in a room, in my room, I feel so depressed. Just place it under the clay and I feel like uh, I, I've got no aim about my future, about my life. But now when I come here, this one. Okay, now I've got something to do to, uh, to my future and there is lots of things to do. It's really important to have something in your life that's yours. When you're being creative and when you're making something, it belongs to you and nobody else can have a say on it, nobody else can tell you how to do it. That, that's a positive thing. It's given me something to do. It's given me my own thing, so it is nice. You know do something for myself. I thought I wouldn't enjoy pottery. Um, you think of it as someone else would be interested than you, but when you do it, it is quite a lot of fun and it's nice to be able to take home the stuff that you've made yourself. In Afghanistan, I was, it was a big deal for me because I was a shy and quiet person. So in here, it, it made it easier for me to communicate with people and uh, make a friendship. I said to them in, in their last class, you know, they're very strong women. Um, they could do anything they wanted, but they don't believe it. So how do you make that belief? How do you tell those people and show them that they can do that? Because them lasses could do whatever they want. We've completed an evaluation to see how they felt at the beginning of the course and how they felt at the end of the course. And a lot of them said about they feel more confident now being in a group situation. Um, they enjoyed coming to the pottery. It was something none of them had done, so it was like a new skill they were learning. If you want to do something in your life, uh, just try more and build your confidence. We're at a point now where we want to try and really implement the things that we are really passionate about, and that would be helping a, a wide variety of people. So, yeah, that's the aim. Mm -hmm.